Hey guys, today we're going to be opening some sticker capsules from the recent Boston Major and a couple of autograph capsules. So, yeah, I'm recording this the day after the final has ended, and we'll talk about the final uh, real quick before we actually get into the stickers. So let's go to my pick em, and I'll kind of show you guys. I'm not going to talk too much about these because they're not like super important. So you can see these are my picks. Uh, FaZe didn't go 3-0 and zero in uh, the prelims which doesn't make any sense, but whatever. And then I got most of these right, basically, except uh, Envious. And then group stage, uh, once again, SK did not go 3-0 and zero for some apparent reason. And Liquid, uh, I think, won two matches. And then I got quite a few wrong. Astralis was knocked out, very surprisingly. Gambit was knocked out, fairly surprisingly, although Gambit looked kind of strong going into here. Uh, but... The Rasmeda and, most importantly, the playoffs. And you can see I have quite a unique pick. <laughs> uh, uh, oh, gosh. Okay, so let's kind of talk about it. Phase versus Mouse Sports. Easy phase. Not, uh, Navi versus uh, Quantum, as I think uh, Bardoff said it, uh, Dumpster Fire. Quantum Dumpster Fire. So, of course, uh, you know, my boys Navi got through. Uh, G2 versus Cloud9, and then SK versus Fnatic. I kind of knew SK was going to beat Fnatic, although uh, Fnatic is like my favorite team. I'm not going to pick it up, but you know, I have a Fnatic mouse pad. So I'm a fan of Fnatic, but I knew they would lose. It was in their defense, very close. Got to give them that. Uh, but then let's take a look at my G2 versus Cloud9 pick. Uh, I'd say it's a fairly obvious pick before the games start. And you could actually, I'll just spoilers uh cloud nine won the major uh crazy uh but yeah uh g2 went six and zero before uh the playoffs and six and zero g2 i thought they're unstoppable so i picked them to win sk versus g2 is the real questionable one uh would have been questionable but i said you know what i'm going with my boys g2 I don't even know why, but you know what? I put G2 to beat SK, and then I phase versus G2. I said, you know what? Whatever. Let's just put G2 in that spot because I don't. I'm not a huge fan. Actually, I'm. I am a huge fan of Phase Clan. I just didn't want them to win. Just kind of weird. Uh, but yeah. So what ended up happening is Cloud9 beat G2, and then they beat SK, and then they beat Phase Clan. This is weird definitely cloud nine it's that's such a weird pick and i did get a silver sadly not a gold uh but i'm not really mad about it like other majors because even if i would have picked one of these correctly i still wouldn't have got a gold there was no way i would have picked cloud nine g2 not in any universe so i'm not too mad uh i deserve a silver it's pretty good um, my friend got a gold which is crazy uh but yeah real quickly because i know you probably everyone just wants to see the stupid stickers already I'll sum it up with this. I think it's the quickest way. This was the greatest major by far for me, in my opinion. Uh, you got to remember, I've been around for almost every major, uh, so it's not like I watched only one. Uh, out of all of them, I think this was the most hyped, best storyline, best clutches, favorite teams, best players. Everything was perfect. The major had quite a few problems with like stand-ins. But as a major, I think this was the best major. And for Cloud9 to win, it's crazy. Out of all the majors, there's only been like two in America. For Cloud9 to win in their own country with a fairly new lineup, you got to remember, this is the first North American major ever won. And North America has only been in one final ever, which was Liquid in a past major. And that was basically like a mistake. They shouldn't have got there. And before that, basically Cloud9, the furthest they've ever went is to the quarterfinals like two or three majors ago. So for them to just come random, they weren't even at the last major, I'm pretty sure. So for them to come into this major and win it, busted. That's all I'm going to say. I'm I'm actually really sad that I didn't go to it. I went to uh, Columbus. And I was super disappointed because I don't like... Uh, I'm just going to put a cron... Like, big title i just don't like brazilians i don't like their teams i don't like their players uh but that's just personal preference uh yeah so i was really disappointed at columbus i really wish i would have gone because i would have been hyped for this but i'm really glad cloud 9 won i think they deserved it they played great uh skedaddy opt like a madman stewie came with some big clutches he really messed up on one of those last rounds in overtime other than that he did great uh Tarek, 
played out of his mind. Rush, very good support. He did his job. He got uh, kills. Who, who, who am I missing here? Oh, and of course, automatic. How could I forget automatic? Again, same thing. He fragged out. Pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. And then I don't even know this is... I have about a page full of these. I don't know why I have this Flash Gaming. I kind of just bought it. I don't know. I think it looked cool. But obviously, I'm probably going to open it considering my luck. But yeah, if you guys are kind of looking at my inventory, this is what I have right now. This is what I'm rocking. I think I don't know if my last video I had these. These are the knives that I'm rocking right now. I think they look... Look pretty cool. I'm not trying to go super expensive with my knife because the last expensive one I had, I gambled away. Uh, so I'm trying to stick a little bit lower this time so I don't make a mistake again. But let's start, I guess, over here. Okay, so let's start with the Boston Attending Legends. See what we can get here. Uh, I'm hoping for Fnatic or SK. Okay, SK is pretty good. Uh, I'm pretty sure SK is one of the more favorited teams. So you know what? I'm completely okay with that. You know what, I guess we'll just go over here. So these are autographs. So obviously I would love gold autographs. Dennis from Sprout. Ew, I don't want that. Get that out of my... Actually, that might look pretty good on a uh, little eco. For now, though, get that out of my face. I don't want to see none of that. And I guess I'll kind of give my opinion on the players as I open them. Seized. Uh, gross? What? Wait. What team is this guy in? Oh, oh. Uh Oh, is that flip side? I can't even tell. It looked it looks like Sprout, but it, but it sees this isn't in Sprout. I don't even know. Okay, that looks weird. I look like a noob here. All right, whatever. I'll just keep going. I don't really like seized. Not not one of my favorite players. Shocks? Okay. Uh Shocks is cool. Definitely a cool player. Uh I don't see who wouldn't like Shocks, although he disappointed me. <laughs> By losing to Cloud9, which I'm happy they won, but kind of disappointed me a little bit. Olaf Meister, okay, okay, I'm liking it, I'm liking it, of course. Olaf Meister, basically best player for two years straight in that one Fnatic lineup. He was like my favorite player for like two years, completely okay with that. I don't even know who my favorite player is nowadays. I don't I don't want to hop on the band bandwagon, I just say like Stewie or something. Uh, Zeus, don't really like him. So, because he ditched Gambit after they won a major. But, um, I don't really know. I don't know who my favorite player is right now. Can't, oh, okay. Okay, that's a good sticker. It would have been better. If that was gold, that would be worth quite a... If this was gold, that would be worth a pretty penny. Uh, but let's just keep going. So, yeah, Kenny S. Again, who doesn't love Kenny S? Nothing bad. World at it. Ugh. Ugh. Terrible. Nobody likes world at it. And again, nobody likes flip side. I have one friend that likes flip side, but I, I make fun of him because of it. Let's see. Rops. Okay. Uh, basically, the only good player on mouse sports, I'd say. The rest of them are sadly kind of washed up a little bit, in my opinion. Rops is great. Okay. A crystal foil would have been cool, but actually, I think the Kenny S would be worth even more than that. Uh... Basically, any Kenny S sticker is worth more than any other sticker at this point. Maybe the Cloud9 stickers went up in price because of the win. Uh, okay, Chris J. Foil would have been cool, but Shocks, in my opinion, is a cooler player in general. So, you know what? I'm not going to even get mad. All right, let's open another one of these. I'm hoping for uh, Vega Squadron, Phase, Cloud9, or G2, basically. Now, why you got to give me Why you gotta give me that? That thing is gross. Look at it. Ugh. I wouldn't want to touch flip side with, like, a stick. All right, let's see. Come on, don't give me another flip side. Literally, anything... Oh, that's good and bad. I Again, I'd really prefer a team. But you know what? That's fine. Whatever, whatever. At least it's not a crappy team. That's all I'm going to say. Uh, let's see. Krizen? Ugh. I don't even know who the... Okay, well, you, I'll, I'll give him credit. His autograph does look pretty cool. Whoever... That's a cool design. Although, he's on a team that... Nobody knows, and nobody knows him. But he has a cool sticker. Gotta give him... Oh, please, 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 please. Stay, stay, stay. Oh, that's so beautiful. That is so... Wait a minute. Sean? Okay. You know, that... Sean Gares. I'll take it. You know what? That is probably the coo the coolest one. That's literally a heart shape. That, that's great. I'll give it to him. That's great. And, of course, that comes out of the meme that Sean Gares is good-looking. I mean, look at the guy. I don't blame it. Uh, 
I don't even. A lot of casters messed up that guy's name. I'm not going to bother saying it now. That's all I'm going to say. All right. Who we got? Kvik. Another one that's kind of. Uh, I don't know. They don't really like it. Okay. So far, we got an SK, which is pretty good. Kenios, pretty good. Uh, this one, I guess, is okay. Although, I wish I could have gotten an actual team. And the Heart Shangares is pretty cool. I guess let's keep going. Uh, I mean, there's so many choices. I can't really tell specifically which one I want. Nifty. Uh, okay, come on. I don't really want... Renegades isn't something that I'm exactly looking for. And by the way, if you guys are noticing, I'm being really critical of these players. Just because, in my opinion, the scene... So many good players nowadays. Even the best of the best can still be considered garbage in this kind of competitive environment. So, obviously, Renegades, they're way better. Like, they're good players. They're professionals. But in this scenario, with all of these teams, they're obviously pretty garbage compared to everything else. Let's see what else we can get here. Give me something good. Man, I'm getting all these no-name players from these weird teams. Uh, Space Soldiers, I gotta give it to them. They played well in the beginning. Kind of fell off later. I actually do like Space Soldiers. Um... Uh, okay. I don't know how I feel about that. That is a gold. It's pretty good. And that is a pretty cool signature. But, uh, okay, I don't know. Uh, how much is, how much is this worth? Let's see, how much is it worth? It is worth, whole. Oh, it's worth like 20-something dollars. Really? All right. I just made my money back. I will definitely take that. Yes. Okay. You know what? This I when I bought these, I was thinking that would have been a mistake because I'm like, well, these I'm basically losing money and nobody's going to watch this video anyway. But you know what? I just made my money back. So you know what? We're good. Never mind. I'm that's perfect. Okay, you know what? Team the, the I like their logo. It's pretty good. I'll take it. I'll, I'll take it. I'll take it. Uh, let's see. Actually, there's surprisingly not a lot of good teams. Like, cool stickers. Only one Flash Gaming looks cool. But Envious definitely has a cool pattern. So I think Envious would be basically the best one uh, to get. So that's pretty good. Pretty good. I'll take it. Let's see. Hobbit. Okay. Love Hobbit. Uh, he's probably the best player on that team. So you know what? I have nothing to complain about. All right, you know what? Real quickly, we're gonna go over here. Let's open one of these. Bam! Why not? You know what? Just surprise. Let's let's do this. What are we gonna get? Gambit foil. Okay, okay. That's probably pretty cool. Uh, probably one of the best ones in the thing, other than basically SK. Uh, you know what? Let's open one of these. Okay, so these are where the good players are. Let's get some. Okay, and of course, I get something from North, that team that basically just. Uh, yeah, just goofed on themselves. Um, I don't know. I mean, I guess if I'm going to go for the obvious answer, I want some golds. I got one gold, which is pretty lucky. I like It's actually pretty lucky. So, I'm okay with that. Though, I wish I could get like a JW gold or something or Crim's gold. That'd be busted. And I would I would have taken a fur foil. Too bad we get an Adren. Adren's not that bad. Uh, personally, not one of my favorite players, though. Not really a big fan of him. Let's see, let's see. Un wow, another fur foil. Just kind of pat. And that Mao. Wow, I don't even know how to say his name. So, two fur foils have escaped, escaped my grasp. Although, fur, out of all the players, probably annoyed me the most in SK. Uh, because he fragged really, really nicely. So, maybe, maybe he's evading me because he knows that I don't really like him. For the fact that he's a good player. So you gotta remember that. I'm not trash talking him. I'm just mad at him because he annoys me. Another Hobbit foil. Okay. So it seems like the game wa likes Hobbit, but not fur. Let's see what else we can get. Once again, another golden would be pretty dope. Although the chances of that aren't gonna happen. Crims, uh, probably one of my favorite players of the tournament. Although we got knocked out pretty, not not pretty early. I mean, they made it to legend stage, but yeah, he's definitely one of my favorites. He had some clutch moments against a couple of teams. Let's see, Tabson. Uh, 
I don't don't even talk about big. Just they don't exist. They're them making it to legend status last thing was just a fluke. All right, we have one more here. One more. Let's see. Yeah, that is our last one. Uh, I don't really think there's any good players that we could get. The SK people are here, and the Virtus Pro. Okay, you know what? You know what? We can get some good ones. Let's pray for. Oh, I saw fur golden. Ah, oh, JW4 would have been cool. Okay, well that's fine. Okay, guys, real quickly, let's just do a small price check on a couple of these. Uh, let's just see how much this one is, just to kind of see it in perspective. You know, what? we'll just do it from here, uh, from my actual inventory. Can you see my inventory? Okay, you can't see my inventory. Well, that one right there is less than a dollar. Uh, the NVS less than a dollar. Well, actually, most of these are probably less than a dollar. Uh, how much is the Sean Gares foil? That one's two, not that bad. How much is the Kenny S? The Kenny S is 40. How much is the Kenny S foil? Two dollars. Okay, so basically, uh, the golden boom, uh, bombla boom, whatever, twenty-one dollars. That's we technically made our money back with that, which I'm completely okay with that. But yep, that is pretty cool, guys. Um, no, I I made my money back basically. I just got some free stickers, so. I'm completely, I'm completely okay with that. Guys, thanks for watching. If you did enjoy it, make sure to like and comment as a personal channel. And I will see you guys later. God bless and goodbye.